Okay, today we're here to talk about cheap solutions to real spring reverb for home recording. I'm going to preface this video with saying I have no idea what I'm talking about. I'm very new to the recording game, so don't take my word for gospel at all. However, something I do know about is being cheap. And this is a cheap solution to getting that analog sound. Because, let's be honest, nobody likes digital reverb. Get rid of that crap, right? So... A lot of the spring reverb stuff I see on YouTube or DIY is running it through a guitar amplifier and using the reverb there. That works. It works pretty well. It works very well in a lot of situations. But for me, the reason I don't like to do that is one, you have to buy a reamp box to do that. And two, I forgot where I was going with that. Two being, oh, Yes, guitar amps are going to have some sort of sonic quality that changes the music somewhat. This is meant for listening to records, um, putting reverb on some records you're listening to. So this is going to be as bad as neutral as you can get. Of course, it's not going to be perfectly neutral, but it's better than a guitar amplifier, I guess. I don't know. Like I said, I have no idea what I'm talking about. Anyway, I'm going to make this short. I'm just going to play a short thing I recorded... Uh, couple minutes ago and I'm gonna add some reverb to it as we're listening to it and um, another thing that's great about this that I didn't mention is it's line in line out so like I mentioned before you don't need a reamp box like going to your guitar amplifier this is bam line to line right let's just let's just hear it man what are we waiting for now I'm gonna mess with the reverb time as it as it goes two. one two three it's pretty much off now. Add a little bit. I think that's a sweet spot. Add a little more. This is way too much, but for the sake of the video. So you get the idea. I don't know. I think it sounds pretty good. Uh, I guess you, someone's watching this, hopefully somebody, you could be the judge. Um, they're pretty cheap. I got this bad boy for uh, 40 bucks off Craigslist. Don't look on eBay. You're going to be spending for 200 bucks. Ain't nobody got time for that. That eBay prices are ridiculous. Um, yeah, search locally for stuff. Cause you know, there's a bunch of these laying around. Um, and it's got this cool little thing. Look at that. Look at that shit. That's pretty cool. Um, yeah, I guess that wraps up the video.